శ్రీ ఓఎస్ జగన్మోహన్ రెడ్డి ఆనరబుల్ చీఫ్ మినిస్టర్ శ్రీమతి ఓఎస్ బిజయామ వైఫ్ ఆఫ్ లెక్ట్ డాక్టర్ వైఎస్ రాజశేఖర్ రెడ్డి ఫార్మర్ చీఫ్ మినిస్టర్ ఆఫ్ ఆంధ్రప్రదేశ్ డిప్యూటీ చీఫ్ మినిస్టర్ చైర్మన్ అండ్ డిప్యూటీ చైర్మన్ ఆంధ్రప్రదేశ్ లెజిస్లేటివ్ కౌన్సిల్ కేబినెట్ మినిస్టర్స్ చైర్ పర్సన్స్ ఆఫ్ వేరియస్ ఆర్గనైజేషన్స్ అడ్వైజర్స్ టు ది గవర్నమెంట్ చైర్ పర్సన్ జిల్లా పరిషత్ ఎన్టీఆర్ డిస్టిక్ మేయర్ అండ్ డిప్యూటీ మేయర్ ఆఫ్ విజయవాడ మున్సిపల్ కార్పొరేషన్ మెంబర్స్ ఆఫ్ పార్లమెంట్ ఎమ్మెల్యేస్ ఎమ్మెల్సీస్ చీఫ్ సెక్రటరీ గవర్నమెంట్ ఆఫ్ ఆంధ్రప్రదేశ్ విజిలెన్స్ కమిషనర్ కమిషనర్ ఆఫ్ ఎంక్వైరీ డైరెక్టర్ జనరల్ ఆఫ్ పోలీస్ గవర్నమెంట్ ఆఫ్ ఆంధ్రప్రదేశ్ స్పెషల్ చీఫ్ సెక్రటరీస్ ప్రిన్సిపల్ సెక్రటరీ జనరల్ సెక్రటరీస్ హెడ్స్ ఆఫ్ డిపార్ట్మెంట్స్ కలెక్టర్ ఎన్టీఆర్ డిస్టిక్ కమిషనర్ ఆఫ్ పోలీస్ విజయవాడ కమిషనర్ ఆఫ్ విజయవాడ మున్సిపల్ కార్పొరేషన్ వైఎస్ఆర్ అచీవ్మెంట్ అవార్డ్స్ కమిటీ మెంబర్స్ మెంబర్స్ ఆఫ్ ప్రింట్ అండ్ ఎలక్ట్రానిక్ మీడియా ఏ వెరీ గుడ్ మార్నింగ్ టు యు ఆల్ ప్రియమైన సోదర సోదరి మానవులు అందరికీ నమస్కారం at the outset i convey my best wishes to all on the occasion of andhra pradesh state permission day it gives me immense pleasure to participate in today's program to present dr ways lifetime achievement awards and dr oisr achievement awards 2022 i am happy to know that these prestigious awards are being presented to individuals and institutions who have been selected for the extraordinary ordinary contribution to society in the field of agriculture health education art and culture literature women empowerment and protection and media I congratulate all the winners of Dr. Vaisar Lifetime Achievement Awards and Dr. Vaisar Achievement Awards. I wish to say that the awards presented to you is a great recognition of the invaluable contribution made by you in your chosen fields that made a difference and influence the society the rich cultural heritage of andhra pradesh can be perceived from its melodious music scintillating dance forms delectable cuisine egregious arts and crafts and its progressive people Andhra Pradesh owes its rich cultural heritage to the several dynasties and empires that ruled the state in the ancient times like the Satavahans, Iksu Bhakusu, Pallavas, Eastern Chalukyas, Kakatayas, Kalingas and the Bijaya. nagar empire etc in the world of creativity andhra pradesh has produced a high position in the work of art the state is undoubtedly a prize gem in the crown of the indian glory the releasing dishes of andhra cuisine including Pulihara and Gangara Pachedi are a must on the every festive occasion. Andhra Pradesh is a multi-talented state from technology 
to arts and crafts that comprises of remarkable range of handicrafts, paintings and handlooms. The Kalmakari work produced Sri Kalasti is famous for its intricate hand painting on the fabric. Andhra Pradesh has always been known for its wide range of performing arts, including dance, drama, and music. The Kuchipudi dance drama performs with its roots in the ancient Sanskrit text of Natya Shastra, which originated in Kuchipudi village is indigenous to Andhra Pradesh. The greatness of Telugu literary history lies in the fact that flourished from more than 1,000 years without any break, known as Mahabharata marked the beginning of Telugu epic tradition. Mahabharata in Telugu, written by Kavitriyam, Nanaya, Tikana, and Arana was started in the 11th century and completed in the 14th century and remains as the largest classical work composed to Mahabharata written in other regional languages. Andhra Pradesh has been known since ages for its rich musical heritage for being the homeland of Kagaraja, Samasastri and Muthuswami Dikshita, the three prodigious Muthuswami the three prodigious mentors of Carnatic music, Trinity and the Telugu language make the true essence and spirit of Carnatic music. Andhra Pradesh is a top destination for pilgrims in the country as some of the most revered temples are located in the state like Lord Venkateswar of Tirumbala, Sri Malikarjun Swami Temple in Sri Sailam, Lord Shiva Temple in Sri Kalasti, Lord Narsingha Temple in Simacharam and Avavilam, Sri Kanukadurga Amabhari Temple in Vijayawada, etc. Andhra Pradesh has given birth to eminent personalities like Manam Birudu Aluri Sitaram Raju, whose 30 feet bronze statue was unveiled in Bhimabharam by our Honorable Prime Minister Sri Narendra Modi as part of the Azadi Ki Amrita Mahotsav celebrations in commemoration of 75 years of independence. Himalayadu Narasimha Bredi, Andhra Kesari, Tanguturi Prakasham, first Chief Minister of Andhra State, Pingaru Bhankaya, the designer of her national flag, N.G. Ranga, Poti Sriramulu, whose supreme sacrifice led to the creation of a separate Andhra Pradesh. Outstanding educationist, C.R. Reddy, founder and first vice chancellor of the university, etc. One can go and analyze the list of eminent personalities from Andhra Pradesh who made a mark in any state and the nation with their immense contribution in different fields is very long. Dr. O.S. Rasekar Reddy, former Chief Minister, 
United Andhra Pradesh, after whom the awards are named and being presented today, made a permanent place in the hearts of the people of both the Telugu states. Dr. Vyasar, love for development of agriculture sector and implementation of pro-poor welfare programs on a saturation basis is unparalleled in the country. He is remembered for implementing a well-led out agrarian and welfare policy. If agriculture, loan waiver and major irrigation projects were the key components of his rule, the welfare part consists of weaker section housing, social pensions, free education and medicine. Dr. Raj Sakharidi held an impossible political record of having served as a member of the parliament for four terms and as MLA for five terms. People on preaching love and affection for him can be gushed from the fact that he had won every election he contested, which is a rare distinction in India's political history. His three-month-long Vadajatra in 2003, covering the length and the breadth of Andhra Pradesh, took him closer to the people from every walk of life and gave him an opportunity to understand the people's aspirations and the problems they face their day-by-day -day life and enabled him to connect with the people at grassroots level. After he became the 14th Chief Minister of the United Andhra Pradesh in 2004, he launched a slew of welfare programs with an aim to alleviate the suffering of the poor people that he witnessed during his Padadatra. More popular among the welfare schemes implemented by him were the free electricity to the farmers, Arugya Sri, 100 aid free emergency ambulance service, Pavala Bhadi, a low interest loan scheme for women's self help group, weaker section housing scheme, reimbursement of college tuition fees for the underprivileged section of the society, etc. Although his tenure as chief minister, Dr. Vais Rasakaridi laid emphasis on welfare of the downtrodden section of the society with a majority of programs targeted at reducing rural poverty. Jal Jagam project commenced during his term to irrigate 40 lakh hectares of land through the construction of major, medium and minor irrigation projects has helped the state to make a significant progress and made agriculture sustainable and doubled the income of the farmers. The continuation of the pro-poor welfare program started by Dr. Vais Rasekar Reddy by the successive governments stands as a testimony to his vision and foresight. Let Dr. Rasekar Reddy is regarded as a natural leader and he will always be remembered by generation to come for his contribution for development of the state. I wish the state of Andhra Pradesh progress further 
by all round development of all the sectors especially agriculture health and education i once again congratulate and wish best for the people of